Today I thought it would be fun to introduce you to a little bit about Illustrator, utilizing two really important tools in the program that allow you to select objects and also allow you to steal color, to apply color to an object. So in Illustrator, you have something called the fill, which is the inside of a color of an object, and the stroke, which is the border. In this instance, we're just going to color in our fills, and I've provided you some color swatches underneath each scene. For this, you're going to choose either the scene on the left or the scene on the right. You can mix and match all the colors you see below to utilize it for your design. So to zoom in in this program, it's Command plus. To zoom out, it's Command minus. So let's say I wanted to color this scene. I would get a little bit closer so I can really see the detail. The two tools you're going to utilize today, the first one here is by default the tool that's activated. It is called your selection tool. It lets you select something so that you can in fact edit it in some way. The second tool we're utilizing today is called your eyedropper tool. It looks like a little dropper, and this allows you to steal color, which is really convenient. So let's say I wanted my tree to be this brown. I can just click down on the brown, and my shape will now become the color. Some misconceptions that happen is that people will often accidentally click somewhere else, and as long as the eyedropper is selected, it will continue to steal color. So what you want to do, if you make a mistake, is hit Command Z or Edit Undo up here. And every time you're done coloring, you want to swap back to your selection tool so you don't inadvertently steal color from some place you don't want. Sometimes this becomes tedious, so I recommend using your quick keys. They're just quick ways of activating a tool. The quick key for the selection tool is the letter V on your keyboard. The quick key for the eyedropper tool is the letter I on your keyboard. This way, you can just swap between one and another without even having to go searching on the toolbar. Right, get creative, have fun. And good luck.